we're going to look at figure number 153. That's King David. A J. Now we're going to move on and look at figure number 121. That's the Apostle Paul. Again, clearly a J. All right? Now, this is figure number 139. That's a depiction of the resurrection of Lazarus. And everybody in that image is dark skin. All right? Here's another one. King Solomon. Figure 156. Clearly a Jake, a so-called black man, an Israelite. And this one I've been showing you throughout the video. This is St. Basil, for whom a cathedral was built by Ivan the Terrible. Clearly a so-called black man. Here's another one. A picture of the Last Supper, figure number 140. Clearly the image of Jake's. So all this is showing you is that these black icons were being painted at the same time the Renaissance was going on in Western Europe. But the Most High allowed these images to survive even up to today to prove that the real Israelites were Jake's. And a lot of this art predates Renaissance art. That's the key. A lot of this art predates Renaissance art. You can go to the 900s during the reign of Vladimir the Great and find black icons. And Vladimir the Great was a black man. He was an Israelite. He was the father of Boris and Gleb, the princes that I showed you guys earlier in this video. They're his sons. You can see them on your screen right now. They're clearly Jake's. All right? So this is just a quick video that I put together to give brothers and sisters a little bit of the history of the Russian icons. Nothing too deep, nothing too major. Just a little bit of the history so you guys can have a clear idea of why the Russian icons are dark. It's not by happenstance or coincidence. And also why we use them. Basically just to edify our people. There's nothing really deep about this stuff. There's much more weightier matters in the scriptures that need to be dealt with. But these things can be used to edify our people. And once our people see themselves in the scriptures, which is something I've been preaching for a long time. Once our people see themselves in the scriptures, they will be able to move on to the weightier matters of the scriptures. So with that, for those of y'all that are watching this on YouTube, I'm going to cut this short and I'm going to add a little bit more uh, to, the vi to the same video on our website. So if you want to see a little bit more, I'm going to show you guys Vladimir, Boris and Gleb and other things uh, in a further edition of this video, a longer edition of this video on our website. Because as you guys already know, there's an attack on all Israelite uh, videos throughout YouTube. People are hating, whoever it is, they're hating. So it doesn't make sense loading long videos that are only going to get taken down anyway. All right. So with that, I say peace and safety to the nation of Israel. You guys know where to find us. Yasha Allah Library. And if the video gets taken down, www.therealjewsofblack.com, where the rest of this video will be posted. Shalom.